guys, it is Crystal and welcome back to my channel. Today I want to talk diaper bags with you. I just downsized my large Lily Jade bag that I have had for years into a smaller bag and I have been loving it. I've had it now for probably about two or three weeks, maybe three weeks, almost a month I'd say, and I have been loving it. It feels so great to not have to carry around so much anymore. So a little backstory, I have four kids, six and under. I have a six-year-old, a four-year-old, and then I have two-year-old twin boys. So this mama is busy and does not have time to be lugging around a huge diaper bag with all kinds of stuff. I have enough, like my arms are full trying to like hold the boys that I just really needed to downsize my bag. They're kind of at the age now where they don't need as much when we're out. We don't need to worry about bottles as much. And you know, it's just, you don't need as much stuff. I don't need a ton of toys and things like that. As long as I have snacks and a couple of diapers, I feel like we're good to go. So I was interested to make the change. And so I got rid of my Lily Jade. I sold that and I bought this bag and I just have so many great things to talk about it. Um, I did buy this from Nordstrom and it is the freshly picked, oh I just put my keys in there, freshly picked, this is the mini convertible diaper bag backpack and it is literally so cute. I chose this, it's kind of like a camel color just because I wear more shades of brown than I do of black um, but it does come in gray and black as well. I will link it below in case you are interested in it. They also have a larger version so if you do have like a newborn or you're still in kind of that baby phase, they do have a bigger version version of this as well. Um, so I'll link that one too. But um, I've never owned any freshly picked items. This is kind of my first <laughs> my first experience with it. And so far it is so great. At the end I'll show wearing it, but it's just like the perfect size. I feel like it's a diaper bag, but I can also use this as just like an everyday bag for myself. Even if I'm not with the kids, I've actually brought it out shopping with me a couple times. It's just super convenient and I have been loving it so far. So this is the mini version. I'll show you what is in my bag and I'll show you kind of, you know, some of the features of it. I did bring, so one of the important things I was looking for because I have twins is that it has cup holders. So there are two pockets on the outside right here that you could put drinks and then there's a couple of pouches on the inside as well. I brought a cup here, a water bottle. So the twins, more or less when we're out now, will bring bottles that have like a closing lid or like top. Um, but you can see it does fit in the side there. So you could put, I mean, one here and one there if you wanted and it works. I mean, it does the job just fine. So you can see that you can fit like a, a bottle in there. So that is nice. I use this outside pocket here as kind of like my quick reach go-to item. So I have my keys, a little hand back. I have a lotion, just a Bath and Body Works. It's kind of like one of their mini lotions. I always have to have lotion. And then I have some chapstick. This is the Grove Mint Lip Balm. So that all fits in here. I could probably fit like a card holder if I wanted to, just really lighten up, um, but I don't. I just like all like my quick and easy on the go items in that pouch. So. I'm gonna put all this back in because yeah, it's just easier to do that. So you can see it has like a nice hook here. I've hooked this onto our stroller with like those mommy clips that you see. Um, so that's been easy and nice. And then also, I don't know, just really convenient for carrying it around if you just wanna carry it like that as well. Um, it does have some straps on the back. They are adjustable. Now it does say this is convertible into a crossbody, but I'm just not quite sure how that would work. Um, yeah, I don't know, but it does say that that is an option for this bag as well. Um, so I prefer the backpack option, but it's so cute. The zipper actually has like a little fringe thing on the outside. It's so cute. It gives it kind of a little fun detail there. Um, so I don't have it zipped up right now because I was just digging in it, but it does have, I'll zip it for you so you can see, has a zipper top which is really nice so if it gets knocked over, things are not like tipping out all over the place. And then it does also have like snaps right there on each side so you can close it so it keeps like its cute little shape. Um, but if you overpack it like sometimes I have, you can have it unsnapped as well. So let's go ahead and take a look inside. 
So that is what is inside. The reason I really chose this one was because it did have some pockets on the inside. It kind of sets it apart from some of the other backpacks that are this size. Uh, I just really need the pockets for organization. Specifically, like if I wanted to put drinks in here or snacks, that kind of stuff. It's just really nice that they're all in kind of like their separate little pouch. Um, let's see, so I in here have three diapers. I don't know why three, just three, because two for one for each boy and then one extra, I guess. I have just like a little disposable pack of wipes, which this one is almost gone, but we like the Huggies Natural Care. That is our my favorite kind of wipes, hands down. So yeah, we always get that one. So we're kinda, I don't carry a lot in here now. It's so nice. So when I sold my diaper bag, I actually got rid of like my changing pad cover. I don't like to change the boys in public if I don't have to, their diapers. I'd rather just like go home or do it in the car. Um, so I didn't wanna go out and buy like a really nice changing pad that we probably wouldn't use. So I bought some of these. These are just disposable ones. They're the Munchkin brand. You can see it's super thin. It's not like big and bulky like those like changing pad rolls <laughs> that you can get, um, but it's really nice. So I use these over the weekend. You just open them up, lay them on the changing table, and then you toss it when you're done. So you're not putting like that icky stuff back into your diaper bag. I just never got that with changing pads. like. So after you change them, you wrap it all up and then you have to put it back in like your clean-ish bag. So I do like that these are disposable. It just seems like more sanitary, if that makes sense. So I bought a pack on Amazon. I will link them below, but super nice if you're wanting to be like more lightweight, less is more type of thing. I've been really liking these. So got those in there. We also have some of these Kleenex. Good to have tissues, especially now that it's kind of starting that cold and flu season. A subscriber actually sent these to me. So these are really cute Mickey ones. They're the Kleenex fan. So cute. I could hook them on if I wanted, but I just love those. They're so cute. So super lightweight. I also have a pack of wet ones just to keep their hands clean. What else is in here? We just came back from a weekend trip, so I'm kind of scared to see what's in here. Another diaper, so I guess I have four four diapers. Now we do cloth diaper, but those are just so big and bulky that I don't like to carry them around and have to worry about once I change them. So I do prefer disposables in my diaper bag, but we do cloth diaper when we are at home. Just in case someone was like, I thought you cloth diapered. Now I have a bag of fruit snacks in here. I honestly don't remember putting these in here. And a little bag of Skittles. So these must have been treats for over the weekend. So a necessity in my bag are fruit snacks for sure. This, not necessarily, but I'm kind of glad it's in there. Maybe I'll have to have that now or when we're done recording. I also have like some graham crackers. These are from my Dollar Tree haul that I did not too long ago. So those, and you can kind of see now there's, I had like all my snacks in this pouch right here. And then there's two like side pockets. Can you see that? There's two little, it's gonna be hard to show you, but there are two little side pockets there that you could also put drinks. I have also done that option as well. And then I also have my wallet in that kind of, this is like my pocket that I get to myself. So I put my wallet in here. Right now I'm using this Teddy Blake wallet. I will probably be talking about this in a future video, but I do love this wallet. I love the red. I think it's gonna be perfect for the holidays when we're out holiday shopping. So I just think that that is so cute. This holds everything that I need, so love that and that's pretty much it in this big pouch right here in the main area and then there's one back zipper pouch right here and in there this is kind of my secret one so if the boys are like digging in my diaper bag i don't want them to look in here type of <laughs> pouch <sighs> let's see here so and the reason i don't want them is because generally i have like suckers and fruit snacks in here, which they are always looking for if they're looking in my bag because they know mom has suckers in her diaper bag. <laughs> so I hide them. So I just put like a good stash of them in my, uh, in a Ziploc in here and kind of zip it closed so they can't find it. But I do need to replenish that because we were just gone. I also have sunscreen, which I don't really know that we need that. We aren't gonna be outside much and now that it's like 20 degrees outside, but I had a little travel sunscreen in there and I think that is about it in here. Nope, I lied, these were also in there. These are like super thin bumpkin bibs. I could probably even take these out. They won't use bibs, they will not keep them on. So I'm probably gonna take these out as well. Um, but that's it, that's all I keep in my bag for the twins. It's like 
everything that we need, literally. We don't need Tylenol, we don't, like all that stuff I can keep in my car if I need to. Extra diapers if we're gonna be gone all day. More snacks, more drinks, all that stuff I can leave in my car and if I need to go get it, I need you to go get it. Go get it. But yeah, you guys, I've been loving, loving, loving this backpack so much. It still looks brand new after using it for a while. Super convenient and it's just the perfect size. So let me try it on and show you what it looks like. Okay, got my bag on. It's so lightweight, so nice. But it's just like the perfect size. It's still, it's cute. Like it doesn't scream, I'm a diaper bag. It just looks like a really cute leather backpack. It's adorable. There you go. Yay. That's gonna wrap up kind of my mini diaper bag update for you. I hope you enjoyed this. Let me know if you're considering downsizing. It literally is just so nice to only grab one little bag and go out the door versus lugging the giant bag over my shoulder with things that we're not using anymore. I just feel so great. It's just refreshing. It's just kind of a new stage of life and I'm loving it. So anyways, thank you so much for watching. I hope you will subscribe if you are new. Stick around, lots of more mommy videos, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.